Greetings, I'm Mr. Sean, and welcome to my channel. And today, we do not have a Warcraft cooking review. I'm sorry. We have something better. We have the latest compilation of recipes from Chelsea Mon Monroe Cassell, the Hearthstone Innkeeper's Tavern Cookbook. It is a lovely little book. So, it's got a nice little embossing on the cover. It feels very nice. It's much, as you can tell, it's much smaller than the previous book. There's only 50 recipes in here. Plus a few more tips and tricks on a certain th certain things for garnishes. Because this is a tavern menu as you look over it. It's all about the drinks, the cocktails, the mocktails, the garnishes, sauces, savory bites, basically entrees, and then of course desserts. So, there we are. A few more recipes to add to the compilation of Warcraft Cookbook. And it's just as beautiful as the previous. I mean, got a message from Hearth, Hearthstone. Beautiful imagery uh, in the style of Hearthstone artwork and colors. I mean, it is just a beautiful book. Even down to the Dark Iron Minion. So, <laughs> there's going to be some good things in here that I've been looking over and trying to get ready for, prepare a segment. And I plan to start using these real soon. So, we got great dishes like Midi's Signature Cocktail, Carazon Cocktail, excuse me. Or we got the Goblin's Wobble. It's gonna be interesting to try. But most importantly, we gotta get to the savory sweets where we have to Unleash the corn dogs. <laughs> it's gonna be a good one for sure. We got some. Some people would call it poteen. But we'll call it the grim patrons tater tots with some gravy and curds and tater tots. Did I say that? Anyway, it's gonna be really good. It's, it's, looks. It looks just looks delicious. Jeez, thankfully, I'm not seeing a lot of errors. If you bought Warcraft cookbooks in October of 2016, there were a few missing ingredients or a few measurements missing and or a few errors in the directions. Hey everyone, after recording this video, I should have made this clarification. If you buy the Warcraft cookbook today, it has been corrected. After the initial sale in October 2016, it appears that they reprinted the book and made numerous corrections to the instructions, ingredients, and the measurements. So it's good to go if you buy one today. Also, one thing I forgot to mention is that the Tavern Chef has made corrections within his own cookbook. From time to time, you'll see a strikeout of a measurement or an ingredient, followed by the chef's writing above the strike what he changed. So it makes it a little interesting, a little more fun. <laughs> Anyways, back to our program. Before I, what I've gone through is quickly, I have not seen any issues and I've, of that sort. So. Looks like they've done a good job editing it, making sure that everything was there. So, hallelujah <laughs> on that regard. And, of course, this looks pretty darn good. Some pizza. It's going to be looking real. This, I mean, this, 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 this is really looking amazing. Of course, we've got to learn how to make funnel cakes. Never done that before, so that's going to be interesting. But so, I think we're going to some of the drinks. Like, here's a little death rattle. As you can see, there's some beautiful pictures, beautiful graphics. It's really easy to read and understand what's going on. We got the tar and tippler. We got the prep time, how many servings it makes. I mean, it's just some beautiful artwork, it's beautiful, gorgeous pictures. So I'm highly impressed with it so far, and I can't wait to see what comes of this. I showed you some great recipes already. So you're gonna soon see a whole new segment called the Hearthstone Cookbook Reviews. I'll be adding those. We'll be doing that. Uh, I'm gonna do two Warcraft cooking videos followed by one Hearthstone. Then go back to two, back to one, and we'll eventually get to the point where I'm done with Warcraft Cookbook and I will jump into more Hearthstone. So this is gonna take me to the end of next year if I plan it all out. So and if I don't miss any more, I'm sorry. I already have some food for the next Warcraft review. It'll be coming out soon. Um, probably after this weekend. 
I'll do it early because, you know, I've been lazy and busy and we have to do it sooner. So, and, and Thanksgiving is coming up. So, I got to do that, that first early. So, because I'm not going to do it on next Thursday because that's Thanksgiving. It's going to be really, really busy. To me, and that's also going to be a horrible weekend for me. So, I, because of my job. Anyways, hope you liked this review. I can't wait to jump into it. And because it looks just as good, if not better, than the original. So, look forward to it. Thank you very much for joining this video. Leave a comment down below. Leave a like, please, and subscribe to my channel so you can see my workout cooking videos. I appreciate you. I had a wonderful time over the summer. And a lot of the videos I've been sharing over the events of Solid Comic Con. You've been enjoying those greatly. Thank you very much. Thank you for the new subscribers that have signed up in the recent months. I will see you next time.